Julia, congratulations. Uh, best way to finish this trimester and heading home before the World Championships. How happy, how relieved, how tired are you? <laughs> Very happy, of course, and uh, yeah, a bit tired now. Uh, I really want some day at home and uh, have some time with my family and friends and uh, some sleep, some really good sleep in my bed. Uh, yeah, it was uh, a nice uh, trimester. It's nice to see, to feel that my shape is going better and better. So I'm really happy and uh, it's a lot of confidence for the next week. But, uh, talking of confidence, today you were the fastest in every single shooting, including 16.9 uh, standing shooting in the third one. Um, uh, did it feel that fast for you or was it all under control? I'd feel both, <laughs> I think. <laughs> so I feel uh, in my prone, I feel really very confident and uh, yeah, I, I did a really great job. And uh, in standing, I say, okay, maybe I can have some fun. <laughs> uh, I think I, I made a mistake because I was too fast on the first one. So I said to myself, okay, you had one mistake and uh, now you really need to, to shoot clean this last uh, standing. So take one second more and uh, you will put uh, the bullet inside the target so yeah i'm really happy uh, i feel i feel like i have now uh, two different shooting uh, the shooting uh, that i had in the individual more calm and uh, and this uh, this shooting that for me it's uh, easiest uh, way to shoot uh, shooting when i don't think and just have fun and uh, yeah enjoy the, the moment and uh, yeah it was a really nice race and i, I love when uh, when i can have this uh, this feeling behind my rifle and on the tracks how was it i think uh, very loud as well yeah very loud a lot of french uh, fans so yeah it's uh, it's nice and a uh, lot of also italian fan but uh, i hear that they were also cheering for me so i'm really happy <laughs> and uh, yeah it was uh, difficult because i didn't think that i will have a five second hide of uh, of lou and uh, other girl uh, after the first uh, prone shooting but uh, yeah i tried to manage uh, to to stay focused and uh, try to ski, but not too fast, uh, because if uh, if, uh, if, uh, but if if there is a battle in the last uh, lap, I need uh, more energy. So yeah, I just try to, to do my rest, stay focused, and uh, shoot clean. And yeah, feeling good on ski. I'm really happy. Red bib in the mass start. You're going to Nova Mesto with that, and also okay, there the points won't count. You said it's your goal, but. You're getting closer to the top three in the overall as well. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> no, um, I think now we need to focus on the world champ, but then we will see. Uh, I know that uh, my shape is uh, going better and better, but we will see after the world champ, and uh, especially with the the, um, the venue in uh, America and Canada, maybe with the jet lag and everything, we will we will see. But uh, the first, uh, my main goal is to the, is the world champ, and then to have some uh, some good race and uh, with good shooting and uh, we will see all the shape uh, is and everything but um, yeah, I'm really happy to have this red uh, red bib of the Masters and uh, I will I will fight uh, until the until the last uh, race thank you thanks Lou congratulations what a great week here in uh, Antol's uh, fantastic performance today how does it feel to get the podium in front of so many fans of yours, your family even? It's so cool to be able to share this with them. It, uh, it was a really great week. Can you tell us your day today? It's uh, really tough to compete on a must start after three weeks in the World Cup here in altitude, but it was almost flawless from you. Uh, yes, I knew it was um, the, the perfect shoot was um, uh, a must uh, to have uh, a great result today. So, uh, so I focused on that, uh, staying in my uh, uh, shooting abilities because I know Julia is a fast shooter and I'm not. So I had to stay on my marks and, uh, and I achieved that. So uh, it was a good day for me. Was there any strategy in your skiing today? Or because we've seen you attacking, then maybe managing, then attacking again? Uh, f uh, when I was uh, with the pack, uh, I found that uh, too slow uh, and I would not uh, uh, Julia to leave for the first place alone. So I tried to, uh, to catch her, but she's uh, really fast. So uh, it was a bit hard. So the maybe it's the two first loop. I tried to follow her. And um, when I saw it was a too uh, energy uh, demanding for me, uh, I just let it uh, 
let the, the people come back behind me. Maybe they can help me to, uh, to catch her again. And, um, and finally, uh, her shooting is so fast. Uh, she made all, all her advance um, with, uh, on the shooting range. And, uh, and I gave all I had uh, left in the, in the last loop. So today's the uh, birthday of one of your uh, waxmen, I heard. Yeah. What's uh, the celebration going to be like? Uh, I would like to give a special medal <laughs> with a funny name uh, written on it. <laughs> I can do a funny thing. I hope to do a funny thing, but it's not that much. I uh, don't. Uh, I haven't prepared a gift for him, so I will uh, uh, think about that for November. So a bit of celebration and then training for the November. Uh, yes, three days of rest, uh, more than celebrating, <laughs> and uh, and then a good preparation back in uh, for November. Congratulations. Thank you. Lena, what a super race to finish, an incredible week for you. Uh, first thing, what's the emotion of this for a place? Oh, it's such a great feeling, especially after the win two days ago and the really good race yesterday. And to just continue on like that, it makes me really proud because that's what we always uh, aimed for and what's the goal. So uh, I'm, I'm so, so happy and it's such a cool feeling. <laughs> Uh, we've seen uh, some great uh, response to, uh, from your coach. Uh, also, how important is it for her to, to see that you're getting used to be one of the top athletes in the world? <laughs> yeah, especially like uh, she, like early on, she was really nervous in the shooting range, and she always said, "Like you're costing me my last nerve." <laughs> and now she's like, "Yeah, I can stand behind the um, and." watch you without getting a heart attack and uh, I'm happy that I uh, continued on like that and uh, improved and uh, it's such a cool feeling to like have everyone around here and supporting me and it was such a great feeling especially after my win there were so many people gratulating me and uh, that feels so amazing. Speaking of today, uh, never easy to finish the trimester with a must start here in altitude. Uh, but you seemed still very fresh, ready to attack all the way. <laughs> yeah, I think today was hard for everyone. And before the race, I told myself, like, just this one more time and then you have some free days. And I think today was all about, like, getting over that limit and pushing yourself hard. And uh, I think that I'm really good at that, to fight on the also um, over the, the like, uh, what's possible, so I'm, I'm really, really happy. <laughs> and speaking of that, the final loop, how was it? Uh, that was a tough one. <laughs> First I saw uh, Lou in front of me and I thought, yeah, maybe I still have a chance. Um, but in the end, I'm really, really happy with the third place and she, they're all really, really strong, strong girls out there and I was just like, okay, in the end, I need to secure that third place. <laughs> you did, congratulations. Thank you very much. <laughs>